Hey guys, so I'm going to be bringing you my November favorites video. So this video is not only late, it's going to be not fashionable and I'm going to even see if this is going to upload because I am filming with my camera and not my iPhone. This will be a struggle because the one thing that I have a problem with is my camera will post to my, it will not upload to my phone. I edit all my videos on my phone because I have this wonderful camera, camera, computer. It's the HP Chromebook. So what that means is I do not have Apple to edit my videos. I movie. I cry. And nothing works to edit on a Chromebook that can't even download a video editor. I mean, it's bad enough that I don't have iMovie, but this doesn't download anything. So it doesn't really work in my favor. So, I'm going to have to upload it to my computer, put it on Drive, and see if it'll download on my phone. Don't know how this is going to work at all. So this is, yeah, this is like a test to see if my camera will be good in the future. So let's get started. <laughs> um, I'm just doing, I don't know how many items I have but I'm going to start with small things. So the first thing is this perfume. This is Beth, the, per, blah, 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 blah. the perfume by Bethany Moda. Um, it's Love Beth. In the, and there's two of these that are like the same thing, except one's black and one's a different color. Get the black one if you want this perfume. This perfume smells so good. It smells like heaven in a bottle. And I don't know how, but it does. So, there's two different perfumes in the same bottle. They just have a different color and they say the same thing, I think. Um, one's completely different from the other one, so. Just like, making sure you guys know. I do not know how much this was. I think it was like $18. I'm not quite sure. And sorry if you hear any background noises. That would either be my heater, my guinea pigs, or my fish tank. Um, my fish tank's pretty quiet right now, so I don't know if you guys will hear it over the music that I'm going to overlay, but I don't know. Sometimes it doesn't work. Just bear with me. So the next two things are mascaras, and I love telling you guys mascaras because I'm not the only one that loves and has a keen obsession with mascara. I, I know tons of people that want to know really good mascaras, so I have two for you guys. The first one that I have is this CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume Mascara in the shade Very Black, which most mascaras are. Um, I really, really like this mascara, and I really suggest it if you guys need some new mascaras. Honestly, it's really good. Um, it's the kind of same shape as most CoverGirl mascaras. Um, it's a... I got two, I have another one in there that I use during the daytime, um, but it's a pink one and I think it's a different style. This one's more for like nighttime, I guess, what you would call it. Um, the brush itself is very thick. It has small bristles, but I still really like it and I just got some on my finger. Um, so that was my first one. My second mascara is by Revlon. This is the Bold Liqueur by Grow Luscious. Um, and the shade is 002 Black Noir. Noir. I don't know how to say it. Um, but I definitely like this one as much. Um, or, uh, this one just as much. Like, I can't choose between the two. Um, the, it's, they're both black. This brush is a little different from that one. This is more of the common brush that you see. Um, it has wider bristles and kind of a normal shape of a mascara brush. While the other ones, I think this is more of a plastic, if I look at it. I think this is a plastic brush and this is more of a hair brush. Yeah, this looks more plastic. I don't know. They're both really good, so you have to try them out. <laughs> My guinea pigs are running around their cage. My crazy lunatics. I don't know what's wrong with them. Don't ask me. I didn't raise them. Kind of did. Anyways, so the next small item that I have for you is a candle by the com the brand Comfort Candle Co. This is their scent Havana. I really suggest this in no October and November, honestly. Just go for it. Go for it all the way. This is the best candle you can buy for... I'm still burning it just because I wanted to get rid of it because um, I have two that I'm burning at the same time just to mix the smells because they're the same smell it's just I'm burning them at the same time just to get 
rid of it because my mom's like, you need to use these before winter and it's winter and still going. It smells so good. It smells like cinnamon mixed with like sweet lavender, lavender milk or something like that. I don't know. It just smells so good. You guys have to try it. It smells like fall. It literally does. And I do not know how much this one was, but if you get the bigger candle, which is like this big, um, it's like $15, I think. I almost ordered another one, but I was like, nah, I'll just savor the two that I have. Um, the next thing is this adorable bandeau, not bandeau, hello, this adorable brassiere, whatever you want to call it, lace cover-up thing. This I got at Sun for $18, and I got it 30% off. I don't know how much it was with the 30% off, but I know for a fact that it was $18. Um, I really, really like this. It's really cute and soft and comfortable to wear under dresses or like shirts like these kind of shirts you want to, that are like see-through, you want to wear something like this underneath it. I really like it. <clears throat> um, on to the next item. This shirt is by Forever 21 and I really, really love this shirt. Um, it just says milk all over it and it's really soft and it's a really comfortable shirt. Um, I'm pretty sure it was like $7 or something like that. It's either $7 to $10. Um, honestly, don't remember. It was a while ago when I got it, but I really suggest if you like comfy shirts like I do, I like wearing comfy shirts and dresses, go ahead and pick one, pick one of these up when you are at Forever 21 or online or anything because these are really soft and comfortable. Um, the next thing that I have, and I might as well just go along with Forever 21 because I have these. These are the most comfortable, like, amazing socks ever. These are so, so perfect for winter. Like, these are my signature socks for winter, and, like, they're now my signature socks because I just got them. Um, like, I got them... I got them in October, like near November, it was like October 29th or something like that, and that was when I went shopping for my birthday, and I didn't use them that much in October because I didn't have the chance to, but I wore them so much in November. I love these socks, and I'm going to be keep, I'm going to keep on wearing these in December. I don't, why wouldn't I? So these socks are the bomb.com, and I think they were like four or five dollars, I'm not quite sure, but definitely worth it just because they're really thick and really comfortable. So worth it. The next thing that I have, and I'm just going to go along with this, <clears throat> um, this, these boots were, I think, $30 to $20. I'm not quite sure. These are Rue 21 boots. Honestly, for kind of like a knockoff shoe brand, that's what I'm going to call it because it's made by ETC. These are super, super comfortable for like the pointy toed boots that you can buy for like $200 or like... Any kind of boots, like, with pointy toes, I'm not saying that, like, it's, if you buy an expensive pair of shoes that are like this, and you know you're going to wear them for a long time, then it's totally worth it. Honestly, I can say that. Um, but we were just at Rue 21, and I love these. Like, these are so, so cute. They have little, um, I'd like to say stretch, stretched latex band on the edges, so they're really easy to pull on. And they have just the back of them. Like, it's really cute because it has these three buttons and embellishments that you can, that are on there. And they're just, it's a, such a simple boot that, that ties into your entire outfit. And they're super cute. And they were really inexpensive. So I really suggest going to Rue 21 or even Forever 21 um, to get some shoes like these. Because simple shoes are the best. On to the next pair of shoes that I have are these. These are not so simple, I guess. Um, they're still considered simple shoes. They're just more fancy I, I'd like to say. Um, anything that has a heel or a wedge or anything that makes you taller is automatically fancy apparently. I don't know why. It's just how it works I guess. These are my expensive shoes. These are what I call my spoiler shoes that I will wear and I will only wear them on the most perfect of days and this is because I do not want them to be ruined. My feet aren't growing anymore, so when I was like, I need some shoes, um, my mom took us to downtown and I found these babies. These are amazing. These were $96 um, and they are Tom High Wedge. These are beige and I am in love with them. The 
ties are made out of metal, like the very end of them. I should know what they're called because of Phineas and Ferb, but I do not. Um, it's The fabric of it is super soft and amazing, and I really like all the little details that they put into the boots just from sewing them and stuff. It's just a really elegant, neat boot that I really love. So, if you guys want to splurge, check these boots out. Boots, wedges, they're um, they're amazing. I love them. So, the last thing that I have for you guys is my favorite sweater of all time that I've bought so far. So far, I'm just going to go with that because ha Christmas Halloween. Christmas is coming and my mom loves giving me Christmas sweaters that are adorable. I got this sweater from Nordstrom Rack. So, the brand is, because sometimes Nordstrom Rack has one-time things. It's like a TJ Maxx. It has one-time things and then you won't get find them. But the brand is Cotton Emporium. And this is like my socks. They're like the they, they're perfect. It's the, mm, I love them. <laughs> I love my sweater. So this sweater is a little lighter color. It's almost like a creamy beige. Um, it's adorable. It's super soft. It has very, very pretty detail. Um, but the bottom is my probably my favorite. It has lace at the bottom of the sweater that goes all the way around and it's super cute and it's basically a triangle lace at the bottom with really, really pretty um, de details and stuff and it's just adorable and I really love it. It's just gorgeous. And you can get one of these and I do not know how much they were, how much it was. I think it was like $20. Um, so it's, it's really, it's really worth it. I love it. It's super adorable and my favorite sweater. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching this quick probably not going up video <laughs> um, I don't know yet it's gonna be it's just quick it's simple I'm doing more vlogging but I'm doing it on my phone which sucks and I don't know but if this video goes up then I'm gonna do more vlogging with my Canon camera because my Canon camera is really really nice it's like a nice camera I just I just need to figure it out because it does not tie in well with my Chromebook. I love my Chromebook. My Chromebook is like my baby, but I'm tempted to be buying an Apple soon just so I can do really good videos and editing and apples are really good too. I, I can't go a day without my Chromebook. I do everything on there. It's just really hard to edit videos because they have these online video editors that make you pay for all that you do. And I wish I had the money to do that, but I just don't. It's too expensive to pay for that. And right now, I had this, I've gotten, I got this camera like three years ago, maybe two. And it was a, I think, birthday gift. And no, I got birthday money and I spent it all on a camera and investment just to take photos and do videos. So I'm really hoping that this camera is going to work for me. Um, I gave up on it for the longest time and I was like, oh, I really want to do videos, but this camera is not working for me and I don't know how to use it. So I'm really hoping that I'll be able to figure it out. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.